Isaac Baston here, Drake, taking second in the NCAA mile. How do you feel about that result? Um, just, you know, so mixed of emotions. It's hard to even describe it. Like, I knew my legs were feeling good going into this, and I just, I'm, I'm very strong tactically. That's something I've always been taking a lot of pride in. But when it comes to these finals, I always just make one little mistake and do one little thing that, that cost me the race. And today, I just didn't give myself, I didn't give myself the room to move up. I was nervous that if I moved too soon, the same thing would happen that did outdoor. And um, I think it cost me, but looking back on it, man, I've grown so much as an athlete over these last few years. And every single time I come here, I do better and better and better, get closer and closer and closer. So, you know, maybe, maybe outdoor is what I need. Maybe it's not, but um, it's a step in the right direction, but you know, just 0 0.03 seconds off of a goal I've had since I was a 10 year old. So, you know, it's just, it's tough, blessing and a curse, but it is what it is. What happened outdoors? Uh, outdoors, I, I moved with like 400 to go. Um, I, well, in, so indoor last year, I didn't move at all because I didn't put myself in position to. And so outdoor, I overcompensated for that moved way too early and then fell apart in the last 150 and then today I'm just I just tried to like mix it you know get that perfect little spot in between there and I did a good job but I again if I moved a second earlier I might win that race so it's just it is what it is but continue to learn a lot along the way yeah I mean it's it's fine margins though because if you time it like just slightly differently if it's 0.03 different or something you're the champ and then you think oh I actually ran a tactically pretty yeah. good race right so yeah. yeah, so it's, it's crazy. Uh, yeah, it's uh, just it's so hard to it's so hard to talk on my emotions right now. Cause it's just yeah, it's just a lot. But yeah, I mean, yeah. coming into this meet, there was so many fast times this year. It's not that 354 what you ran is slow, but you know compared to some of the other times in the field, how do you feel like you stacked up against these guys? I, I knew that didn't really matter that much because first of all, these races are never running 354, but. Second of all, when I ran 354, I had the flu, and not a lot of people knew that. So I was I was running so ill, and like I was just I was feeling so bad. I was throwing up the night before, and so really that day I just kind of focused on getting a time, getting into this meet, and then I knew that once I'm here, I can just prove that I'm a lot better than my seat time is. Yeah. Was there one moment like in today's race where you thought, oh, that was where I should have moved a little earlier? Or? Yeah, yeah. With like about 150 to go. Ah. Uh, so I tried to move around Joe Waskin who's right there, and then um, he he answered my move, so I didn't get around him. Then I cut back in. Mm -hmm. I those moves aren't good at running. You can't half commit to a move, mm -hmm. and I think it was a little bit of that back to back to moving too soon outdoor that I was a little bit worried about. But looking back on it, I wish I would have executed that move. But overall, I still ran a very good tactical race. I mean, Luke Hauser is an incredible runner, so losing him is not can't beat myself up about it too much but man i just so hungry like i want it so bad and i've gotten so close to so many times now so yeah yeah i mean does this tell you like hey i'm moving in the right direction i am improving at this stuff yeah i mean yeah i i truly think when i go to bed every night i go to bed telling myself i'm the best in the instant of life and it's all really just about proving it and i haven't been able to every time i've been here but every time i'm getting closer and closer and closer so who knows, maybe next time I can prove it. Yeah. Nice job out there. Thank you for the Thank time. You.